Hi, sweet boy. Hi. Look at the nose. Look at your face. I'm so handsome. You're such a handsome guy. You are. I know. Show everybody your face, baby. Hi, everybody. I'm just waiting for a minute just to get a few more people on the feed. This is Zoe with 100 Plus Abandoned Dogs of Everglades, Florida. And this is our newest rescue. Um, we just pulled him from Miami-Dade Kill Shelter. His name is Terry. And um, he was found as a stray. Come here, baby. Show everybody your face. He's so beautiful. He's just this poor guy. The entire ride, I am um, just on my way. We're in the vet parking lot. Um, and I wanted to do a live video before he... He has to go to boarding uh, because he needs to be in quarantine. We need to make sure he doesn't have any kennel cough or anything like that. Um, hi, Penny. Hi, Susie. Um, this is Terry, and he is, uh, he was a stray. He was found, uh, Miami-Dade Animal Services picked him up. He had puncture wounds, and um, they were actually... They had an adoption hold when he had puncture wounds and needed to be tended to. And um, Amy had sent them an email asking how they can let an adopter adopt him when he needs uh, medical help. And um, so he was surrendered to the rescue. Um, he is so, so, so sweet. I can't even tell you the whole ride here. I had him tethered in his seat next to me, but he was trying to sit in my lap. So when we were stopped in traffic, I let him sit in my lap and he just curled up. He's a total snuggle boy. So everybody, how cute you are. So everyone, how cute you are. He's just a total love. Hi, Susan. Yes, he is just, he's definitely schnauzer. He definitely has some schnauzer in him. Um, he didn't, his original intake picture looked like this. And um, I was not thinking schnauzer at all until they gave him a haircut and he absolutely looks like schnauzer. Um, they have him as a terrier mix. So he's probably a terrier um, or a, a schnauzer mix. And he is a year old, so he's young. Um, you know, he waited when I when I got him. He was with me in. Uh, we were waiting for some paperwork, and he didn't do any potty inside the building. We went outside. He went right to the grass to do his peepees, and he pooped, and um, he was feeling pretty good. So um, that was a really good thing. And um, again, this is Terry. Uh, we picked him up from a hundred or from um, MDAS from the Miami Dade Kill Shelter. He's about a year old. He was found as a stray with puncture wounds, and um, it looks like he's healing okay. He is neutered. Uh, he does have to go into boarding because um, he needs to be quarantined. He needs to be separate from other animals just in case he has. Uh, any kennel cough because he's been exposed to all kinds of things. However, if we have a someone who will step up to foster him who doesn't have any other pets, that would be his best case scenario because we can't even bring him to the rescue house. Even if we, no matter how much room we have, uh, we have to bring them into quarantine. So if anybody is willing to foster this baby, he's about a year old, super, super, super sweet, just a love. Um, he it would be fabulous. So please reach out 877-506-8100. Here he just wants to he just wants to come and snuggle. He's absolutely beautiful. I'm actually going to show you um he's about 20 pounds. I'm going to go pick him up from the other side. So I'm going to get actually I'll pull him out on this side cuz I have him all leashed up. So we're going to get out of the car. Bear with me here. Oops. <laughs> and we're on live video. Look who it is. Do we have Leslie? Look at the little peanut. 
Hi, oh, sweet pea. That's Terry. Look, his little tail's wagging. Hi, Terry. So, so sweet. And he is uh, he is gorgeous, right? And he's found as a stray. He was found as a stray, and he had puncture wounds. And they were actually letting they had an adopter hold, and Amy texted them saying or emailed them saying, "How could you have an adopter when he has puncture wounds that have to be tended to?" And so he came to us. So I can see some, you know, some on his leg, and I saw something on his head. It looks like things are healing. Um, he is neutered. And um, hi, Susie. Hi, Sandra. Barbara. Uh, he is, he's just, he's beautiful. He's, he's a little sweet. guy. He's super sweet. Just wanted to be in my lap, uh, the whole time. And, um, he's just, he's beautiful. So just a lover, totally a lover. Yeah. So if anybody is, um, interested in either adopting or fostering, like Leslie is fostering this little guy. Look at that face. I can't even stand it. <laughs> and that keeps him. And that, um, just until they get a, a forever home, it does help so, so much. It saves the rescue money. It saves the dogs, the um, stress of being in a boarding environment, in a kennel environment. So, um, yes, that is Broly. That's little Broly. So I'm at the vet, and Leslie was walking out of the vet as I'm about to walk into the vet. So we, we get a little sneak peek at Broly. Don't, don't let them see me try to get <laughs> I'll double move the camera. So, uh, please share this video so we can try and get a forever home or a foster. We have so many dogs that have come into the rescue in the last few days. We do need your donations. Um, we brought in Sparkle yesterday, and she is, um, you know, between the blood work and the spay and the heartworm tests and um, all of her vaccines, the costs really do add up. So, um, again, our number is 877-506-8100. This is Zoe and Leslie and Broly and our newest addition to the 100 Plus family. This is Terry. So, um, thank you for watching and have a great Monday, everybody. Watch the gum that I just... Oh, okay. <laughs>